Hi guys, today we are going to make a video uh, for a clipping pad and here you can see how can we make a clipping pad on Adobe Photoshop. So uh, we are ready to show you uh, how to make a clipping by Adobe Photoshop CS3 or CS5. Okay, let us start. First of all, you need to make a layer on a Photoshop. Uh, here you can see in a path tool and you have to uh, if you can't see in your Photoshop you have to customize your Photoshop by window uh, you can see here is a layer and is a shortcut key is F7 or uh, here you can see the path layer uh, so uh, now it uh, uh, depends on you, if you can customize your uh, Photoshop, you can choose the from any tools from your window. And so, um, here you can see, uh, you're clipping create a new path. It's the uh, uh, most important things, if you are going to work in here, it will be work part. And if you uh, done your uh, clipping in full work path it's gonna be uh, can be delayed by clicking another uh, a single click so you have to be uh, sure uh, this will be make a path layer here uh, speak and must be it's uh, need to be select by uh, and you have to make a clipping path by clicking the your right mouse uh, so here you can see clipping okay and uh, here you uh, some tools in your top of the bottom uh, top of the layers here you can see auto add and delete you have to select this also here you can see the band rubber band if this rubber band means uh, if you click uh, there is no any uh, clue where is it's come from or first you, you have to go so if you click this rubber band this is going to be show this is going to be uh, follow this layer and the line and how where are you from and where you're going to be to the clipping so you have to uh, select the rubber band uh, so uh, let's start the clipping on, on uh, this image first of all we need to click this here and right button on your mouse clipping okay now uh, zoom and you can zoom uh, any any size of it, uh, any any kind of zoom you need. So you can zoom uh, as you want by clicking Control and Space. You can see the zoom uh, icon is a plus, and you can see the minus. If you click in the minus in a left mouse, it will be zoom out, zoom in, or you can be zoom out. So uh, we can start from here first. Uh, the speaking on this pixel line of this image. Then you can see it's in a good shape. So you have to follow this line of this uh, pixel on this image uh, for making a good shape on this uh, product. You can see you can check this layer which is correct or incorrect by clicking zoom out and zoom in so you can see the changes and you can see the line if you are right or wrong you can see so you have to uh, make or you have to follow the line so we are making this uh, here is uh, some pixels or you must have to follow this line because of if you cut the images uh, much more, uh, the client will be not happy and the customer will be uh, not happy because of you. if you cut the image lots more, the product will be lost in this original size. So you have to must follow the pixel line. And uh, you can see uh, if you cut this outside of this pixel, the background will be calm in this uh, pictures, which is which will not be good. So you have to must uh, close as possible to the pixel line. You 
can see uh, this is a almost a almost a five percent of this image. You can see also check the speed mask. Uh, this is a um, very uh, fix in a, your image by clicking on Control plus Enter. It will be make your in a quick mask. Quick mask means you can. Uh, I have this uh, old one, the layer, past layer. So I'm gonna show you how to uh, quick mask and check the background from this image. Here, uh, some of areas, some of images have this curve, and you have to must follow the curve line. And if you, I can show you here. Yeah, here. This is the uh, not much clearer on this uh, image. It's too much light on this uh, item, and you have to make this uh, a little bit darker by clicking this duplicate layer. You can see I have made a, a background copy, and here you can see darker. So, um, gonna be uh, I don't know first one here. Um, Yeah, this work. Uh, you can see you can, if you copy this, there you can see uh, it's uh, lighter than the original bags because of its button as one like a jewelry. And if when you click the jewelry, uh, which is uh, much lighter than the original, so you have to uh, um, make it layer with this multiply. And you can when it's finished, it's done. You may. You may delete uh, this uh, duplicate layers by uh, come out from the duplicate and make the original one. So where is gonna uh, make? Uh, it's uh, not for uh, for all images, but uh, on some of this those files which is not right and which is over over exposed and over light, and so you have to must uh, follow the uh, your mind and which will be take your uh, photos in good position. Anyway, we are uh, we are trying to show you an easiest way to make a clipping. Now it's a uh, it's the bottom of the bags. Here are some dark area which is not much clear. Uh, so you, you can also make it uh, in a duplicate layer. Uh, you can screen of uh, it's like lighter than you can see the line the pixel so if you think uh, this is not right you can select this uh, anchor point and uh, put it down so if you think this is okay it's fine and you may you may delete the duplicate layer so here uh, some gonna make a layer so we are gonna finish it and uh, by clicking this uh, backs and so you can change see the background and already have been changed here uh, if you think it's cut too much you may, you may fix this from clicking uh, by the anchor point and you have to use your control tools and left mouse on a, uh, a key a left key so you have to must follow the pixel lines which uh, is most important it is uh, you can see there is a some of it is a much cut and we have to fix this here we, here we go. No, uh, it's, uh, it's cut too much we're gonna fix this okay now it's, uh, it's gonna quick mask and you can see the changes so um, it's when it's done you went change the background uh, layer and see the changes on a white background or image uh, put anywhere if you want this layer in a transparent background so it's a difference on you if you guys uh, want to put it on a side uh, and color of the background you can put it anywhere if you want you can make it red or any kind of background or if you want to resize it you may Resize by this uh, 
in 1000 and uh, you can see you can see this is an what for devices and which is ready for any website to sell in e-commerce business or any kind of business uh, and it's also ready for publishing or magazine uh, website whatever um, the client needs okay guys uh, today is no more it's, uh, we will come back soon with new videos and new tutorials uh, for making you more experts and more happy bye take care bye bye